we are at Tongmyo, which is a traditional market that has existed since 1980. So it's been around for about 45 years. And they sell a lot of used products. And nowadays, it's very popular because as the trend is going into neutral, which is a mix of new and retro, even a lot of young generations started to come here and do shopping. Let's check it out. Look at this stack of different products. And they got a life jacket, frying pan, a plaque with fake guns. They got a traditional looking base right there too. And right beside, they sell fish cake and cup noodles. What a scenery. And they sell dress shoes with different styles. Oh, those are sick looking leather jackets. A lot of the shops here are very interesting because they don't usually sell one product, but they sell pretty much everything. You go one box, eh? <laughs> a whole box filled with socks is only 10,000 won. That's a crazy price. They got different pots. If you need a charging cable, oh, there's a horse there too. If you need a pet, there's a router. Oh, there's an LV bag. There's a Chanel wallet. Wow, uh, look at all these pairs of Nikes. And what does he have here? Wow. Wow. <laughs> Historic pieces from hundreds of years ago. Look at this old money. Check out this grandpa's jacket. Oh, these shoes are only 30,000 won. They have hiking shoes as well. And these are brand new shoes. Let's see what's here down this alley. Jackets for 20,000 won. Let's see what they have down here. Wow, look at these posters. The old cartoons. Wow. Look at these old school cameras. The store was so interesting. It's a tiny space, but a store had a little bit of everything from digital cameras to film cameras. You never know what you're going to find at a shop in this area. That's the fun parts of shopping and looking around in Dongmyo. It seems like now we're getting close to the main section, the market. Look how many people are here. Wow, these shoes are only 10,000 won, $10 per pair. Look at this whole pile of clothing. They got plush toys as well. Shirts from $4. Wow, oh, they got so many clothing here. It's crazy. Wow, it's a random one. I found the Prada bag. Jacket for 8,000 won. Wow, look at this phone. Those are from like 20 years ago. <laughs> got Korean snacks here. And they got more of Pojang Matcha. 
This is the place. Wow. Bang chon on ya. Look at all these rice cookers. <gasps> wow. What the fuck is there? <laughs> this thing is supposed to be filled with honey inside, but there's not much. It's empty. Wow, look at the size of this toy store. This thing is $840. There's a stadium of Barcelona. Wow, it's a lot of There's even a second floor. And they were featured on one of the most popular TV shows in Korea. Wow. They got so many different types of toys that it's just mind blowing. I would never want to bring my kid here. <laughs> right? If I had a son, he would want to buy everything here. My wallet would be depleted if I brought my kids here. It says that this is a reptile store. That's a shark. Oh. These tiny ones. Oh. Look at these tiny lobsters. Whoa, the guy's getting destroyed. Oh, look at this long one. Now we're entering the area of Dongdaemun, which is known for shopping. Dongdaemun has been one of the main areas in the history of Korea that's known for clothing sales. And a lot of tourists still come to this area to buy clothing. And we heard that there's a Sunday market that opens only once a week. So let's see what they have. These are all $2 or $3 for those pants. I don't have a feeling, right? It's not really open. Why? It's a Wow, what a view. This one is called Cheonggyecheon, which is the Cheonggye stream that runs through the middle of Seoul. And on both sides, these are all the buildings that sell clothing at a large scale typically. So they would ship the products from here to all sorts of clothing stores across Korea. Check this out, a bowl of noodle. Five dollars, six dollars. It's like sweet and sour pork for thirteen dollars only. The price is so much cheaper here because it's around the markets. Wow. It looks like it has been here for a very long time. The 재밌는 게 여기 다 이렇게 한 사람 한 사람 각자 자리가 있는 게 너무 신기해. 오토쯤이야. Oh, it's canon. <laughs> wow. So many jackets. The jackets are so many. The street makes me feel like I have traveled back in time. 30 years ago at least. Oh, that is the warm. Even these signs look like they've been here for 40 years at least. Ah, this is the warm. 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 This is the war
와. 아, 정신 없어. 과연. This is the old school toast. 짜리나 떨렸지. 이건 계란이 없는데. 계란이 너무 조그만데? 여기도 있다. This is one of the traditional Korean drink with different grains inside. 맛있는데? 아니 무슨 샴푸도 팔아. 그러니까 쓰다 만드네. 와 대박. 사람. 와. Look at all these people. So the reason why there are so many people here is because each piece is only a dollar. This must be all dollar too. Wow. Now it's about 5 p.m. and it seems like everything is closing. That is it for Dongmyo, which is the largest used products market in Seoul. It's not really a market for us because we're not into vintage clothing. <laughs> but if you're into that, make sure you check it out when you come to Korea. This is the place that you want to come to because it's got more shops than any other neighborhoods for vintage clothing. But that's it. Thanks for tuning in. See you in the next video, guys. Bye-bye. Whoa, that's a crazy looking bike.